Hey guys and welcome to Aussie Reviews and welcome to my beginner series where we're talking about calibers. So this time we're talking about the 243 Winchester. It's a um, cartridge that has been around for many years since the 1950s and for good reason it's uh, certainly survived the test of time because of the popularity in general. Now it is a neck down 308 case to accept a uh, 6mm projectile so you will see that it is the same size case as the 308 in that regard. Now uh, the pros of it, look it's uh, very versatile in its bullet weight because you can get uh, factory ammunition from 70 grain uh, up to 100 grain and if you reload you can get um, you know, lighter and heavier projectiles in general. So depending on what your um, you know, use is, that really opens up a field of use from taking um, you know, varmints at long range to uh, you know, obviously shooting larger um, you know, medium sized game that you need those heavier projectiles for to make an ethical kill. So it's very, very popular in that regard. Now, uh, the good thing about it is that uh, it is being obviously popular, reasonably cheap to buy. Um, you know, you're looking at around about $1.50 a shot. So, um, you know, it's not one of these sort of odd calibers where you're paying sort of $2.50, $3 a shot. So, yeah, fairly well priced and uh, it's quite a comfortable um, caliber, you know, to use because it just doesn't have the recoil of the 308. So, you know, if you're recoil sensitive, um, but you still want a caliber that's going to do the job on a variety of game, the 243 is definitely worth having a look at. Now, the cons of it, look, there's a lot more noise with a 243 over like a 223. So if you wanted something, you know, in the lower end of the centerfire, uh, calibers and you're trying to decide between 223 and 243 well look 243 um, there is a lot more noise okay um, it also uh, lacks the energy for really large heavy game so if that's your purpose um, and you're wanting to get out there and do that then maybe you'd be better off looking at a 308 now it uh, can be expensive if you start getting into some of the really gucci hunting rounds but we're pretty blessed here in australia because uh, we have Outback Ammo, which this one here is. This is a 70 grain um, hollow point uh, boat tail. Now, uh, you know, it's fairly well priced, around about that $30 for uh, 20 shots. So, you know, but if you look at a lot of the American manufacturers, especially with the exchange rate here, um, it can get a little expensive depending on the round that you use. Now, uh, overall, guys, look, if you're looking for something with um, softer recoil, the 243 is certainly, um, you know, a lot better in that department over 308, 270 and so forth. Um, and it's still capable of taking, you know, like good sized pigs, um, you know, medium sized deer. Um, look, I wouldn't suggest this for Samba deer, but, you know, like for shooting red deer and things like that, um, the 243 can do the job with the correct shot placement and also the uh, correct ammunition. So overall, if that um, appeals to you, it's definitely worth taking a look at the 243 Winchester.